Welcome to Real Physics. These are short clips about unsolved riddles of physics and today I'm talking about the fine structure constant. It's 137.035999 and the rest of the experimenters are still struggling. So what does this number mean? Nobody knows. We can measure it very precisely. We know it's a very deep message of nature because if you compare the speed of an electron in the hydrogen atom, which is the simplest particle in the world, and you compare that speed to the speed of light to get this ratio 1 over 137. So nobody knows because it's 137 or because it's not 2000 or it's not 53. We don't know. And actually nobody has been able to calculate it. And uh, for example, Richard Feynman said, it's one of the great damn mysteries of physics, a number that seems to be written by God and we don't know how he pushed his pencil. Every good physicist should write up this number on his wall and worry about it. It seems that today's physicists don't worry too much about that and uh, I think we should remember that. Paul Dirac, another funny anecdote, uh, when physicists, when two physicists uh, came to him and said, oh, we have a new theory, Mr. Dirac, would you have a look at our theory? He just bluntly retorted, Do you, can you calculate the fine structure constant? No? So come back when you have done it. And uh, well, the fine structure constant, it's uh, technically e squared divided by 2hc epsilon zero, the electric constant, and it's kind of a mix of quantum physics which contains H and electrodynamics which contains the the unit charge and so in a way you could also say this would be the ultimate unification of quantum electrodynamics if you're able to calculate this number but yet we are still far from achieving it. If you enjoyed this video don't forget to like it and if you're interested in fundamental physics subscribe to this channel.